my gorgeous Sagittarius, listen to me very, very carefully. On the 10th of November, you are going to be having situation which is really going to surprise you. You're going to find this situation absolutely mind blowing. But why? what I need you to know is that this specific situation that you're going to come across is first of all going to scare you a little bit, but at least it's going to open your eyes. Your eyes are going to be open and you are going to become fully aware of something for the first time in your life. This is going to reflect on your life. This is going to reflect on people in your life. But this is most importantly going to also reflect on you like realizing how much you've actually changed and realizing almost instantly and almost immediately that the change in your life is needed. This change that I'm talking about is you need to pay attention to what do you you feel like? What are you going to feel like in terms of the actual change? What is this change? Okay. And, and this is an important aspect of your life for you to understand. You can do this both ways. You must understand this. You have to be optimistic. Okay. And you have to be positive because if you are negative at this stage, you are uh, going to materialize negativity. No, baby, no. Do not lock the door where there are no locks there. Okay, do not lock the door with no locks. Okay, the door are open. So it's going to be much easier to start with to be optimistic. You will see exactly what I mean. So it can work both ways, which means that the power of manifestation is going to be eleva elevated. So this is what you need to understand when you come across that situation. This is what you need to remember to be as optimistic and to think what good and positive change this is actually bringing into your life. You need to be as optimistic as possible because you must understand something that you're not going to be able to understand at that moment in time. You're already materializing something. You're already starting some kind of a process. You're already starting with the beginning of manifestation. So I will say again, do not be negative or pessimistic. Be as optimistic and think what this wonderful change, what this change is actually bringing into your life and take it from there. It's going to take an exactly 10 months until this explodes. It's going to take exactly 10 months until one of the most powerful, powerful, powerful manifestation of manifestations of your life become the actual reality. My name is Sasha Bonasin and I'm a psychic medium and this is your monthly horoscope tarot card reading and it's for you my gorgeous Sagittarini and it's for November 2022. When it comes to the actual numerology your number is number 13, 1, 3. Now that means that you know it's very much so strongly I need you to understand the power of the actual this unexpected situation which is going to come into your life. There's something it's going to happen completely unexpectedly and it's going to leave you with a choice. It's going to leave you with an opportunity. Just remember on the 10th of November something is going to happen completely unexpectedly and it's going to leave you with a choice. It's going to leave you with an opportunity. What what the elements of like what I was trying to explain before is like you must not see this as like also like a you can very easily start seeing this as a negative thing because I will tell you why. Do you know when I say don't manifest it, don't think negatively. Um, you can start thinking in a negative way as soon as you have a little bit of a negative aspect around it. So what is going to be on your mind is going to be like a, some kind of like a responsibility. Don't let that put you off. What is also going to be on your mind is like a, some kind of like a really hard work, you know, hard work. Oh, boring. No, baby, no. Take it as a challenge. Take it as a something really sweet. Take it as, as a something really delicious. In that way, you're already 
forming a certain energy in your mind which is going to prevent you to stumble you know at, at the time of your life but you should be just flowing freely like there is no tomorrow just remember that what is going to be happening it's going to bring one of the biggest manifestations of your life into your reality so when you become aware of like there are going to be elements of a hard work but you most certainly should just go for it uh, go for it and go for it do not let put that uh, do not let this put you off at the, at the same time there are still certain rules and certain life that you will need to live uh, you know at the same time that you may not kind of like but the bottom line is that you have to at this stage like kind of be responsible when I say that you need to follow the certain rules few days after that moment in time you're gonna have a bit of a hermit moment the, the, the actual hermit moment couldn't have happened at a better time of your life so you are gonna feel like you want to meditate you are gonna feel like you want to relax a little bit you are gonna feel very strongly like you want to be by yourself you know uh, um, at around the mid November, I can feel this very strongly, and this is indicating the fact that you're gonna find yourself being going so deep where you're gonna be left with no option but like kind of oh my god to search for the big life answers, you know. And then something is going to come to you, something it's gonna you're gonna realize through that hermit moment, this is what's gonna surprise you because you will feel like you want to kind of be by yourself a little bit, which is absolutely fine, which is absolutely normal, but what what is going to surprise you is like you will be thinking about something really specific when you're in this hermit mode you're gonna go oh god this oh god that you know you're just gonna feel like a maybe down a little bit just a little bit and your mind is gonna be going towards all sorts of directions you're gonna be trying to like kind of blame yourself for something completely unnecessary completely not necessary unnecessarily completely unnecessarily i can't speak anymore sorry <laughs> completely unnecessarily but then at the same time you are going to become aware of like who you can trust and who you cannot trust this is an important moment here when you have this hermit moment it can happen in any at, in, at, at any time and in any way so you will maybe want to uh, spend some time in meditation maybe you will want to chill out a little bit maybe you're just gonna lock yourself in the house and be by yourself maybe you will just want to go into the forest however you want to live this moment that's absolutely fine it's happening the way it's meant to happen or it's going to happen the way it's meant to happen anyway but when that hermit moment comes up this realization is going to be important who you can trust and who you can not trust to and this is something that you're going to become aware of you're not going to be able to understand where this is coming from completely out of the blue it's going to be pointed towards the certain person that you should really be careful about you should really kind of uh, uh, be careful about what you say what you come out with something is just absolutely not going to be right whatsoever and this is something Something that you are going to need to accept you are going to need to accept not only that but you're also going to need to accept that you need to speak to this person you need to sort something out you need to put your point across okay do you get what i mean my gorgeous sagittarini you need to speak to this person you need to talk something to this you need to talk to this person. you need to discuss something now and forever this has been like a kind of like um this is not something out of the blue. This is connected to an ongoing problem when it comes to the certain person in your life. But you will realize for the love of God that this has been affecting you way too long and you need to sort this problem out okay and this is only going to be highlighted through this hermit moment okay this is only going to be highlighted who this person is but you're not, not, you're not gonna kind of completely be surprised about this but at the same time you're gonna be surprised because you're gonna feel this urgent feeling this urgency in order to discuss that in order to sort this out normally you will feel really worried but now you're gonna need to sort something out you're gonna need to put your point across and you're also gonna need to explain and say what the problem is and what are you actually worrying about you can only sort this out through the actual direct communication and this is not only between you you and that person it's it's involving and including other people in your life that mean to you the most so this is just part of the process that you're going to need to go through indeed okay let me show you this 
when it comes to you uh, uh, talking to that person and speaking to that person and putting your foot down putting your point across there is something that you're going to become aware of that you weren't aware of before and what you're going to become aware of it's going to be so superb when it comes to sharing this knowledge and sharing this information at the same time to people who mean to you the most okay so just remember this and at the same time when you speak that per to that person almost couple of days late not even couple of days later you will have a karmic reward because you're going to release something from yourself you're going <clears> to <throat> you're going to release the karmic blockage because this has been going this has been going for a while with that person so karmically this was kind of knotted you know so far so it would keep on coming back and becoming heavier and heavier until you finally put stop to this okay and at the same time as a karmic reward couple of days after that moment in time look at this baby here you will be facing a variety of options and you're going to get so excited about it but you will know that only one particular option is what you need to do now a couple of days after that moment in time you're going to be facing a variety of options but one of the options is going to be like a big mama going to be like hello my gorgeous do you know what i mean because the one option that you're going to be facing it's going to be you know it's to do with like a some kind of a new project and it's to do with a new venture and it's also to do with your skill and it's also going to have elements of like oh my god someone like you're going to remember someone saying something like in terms of advice that was not said to you directly but you're going to remember some kind of advice that you became aware of you heard it no one said it to you directly but it's going to be on your mind this is again to the power of the actual synchronicity pay attention to the numbers 333 and 111 as well if you're seeing at around the same time it's only going to be like an added bonus like to pay attention to what was on your mind you know because that particular thing that was on your mind it's also like a kind of like a creating a certain blockage and you need to release it you know so this is also like kind of an added bonus but the bottom line is as soon as you become aware of this new project new venture new skill what i was saying to you you're also going to remember at the same time the advice that you heard not that long ago and you will be able to apply this advice right now because that advice is going to be so beneficial on one hand when it comes to you having a strong mind and, and, and wanting to find out a bit more truth but also at the same time that wise advice is going to give you so much clarity now at this moment in your life because it's going to help you to make not only like an absolutely mind-blowingly mind-blowingly yes baby smart decision Plantini is saying no not only you're gonna be able to make like a smart not only you're gonna be able to make hello not only you're gonna be able to make a smart decision here but also my goodness I don't even know how to say this this is going to bring an ultimate change in your life when it comes to the success you know already by the actual May 2023 you know there is so much there's so many different elements in your life that you will be able to face that you will be able to have around you your life is going to be so much more colorful by then by that particular stage in your life but the bottom line is that you by taking this new project on listen to me this is going to not only bring you ultimate success when it comes to your finances but it's also going to bring you an ultimate happiness when it comes to your spirituality and when it comes to you doing absolutely the right thing at this stage in your life do you see the world here yes baby we are talking about the success we are talking about the achievement we are talking about you being so excited we are talking about you literally changing your life we are talking about like you having an ultimate change you know in terms of success and accomplishment which is going to reflect on every single aspect of your life you know whether you want to move on with your life or not after this stage you're not going to be left with absolutely no option but just keep going forward Forward, keep going forward keep going forward keep going keep going up my gorgeous Sagittarini that's the only thing the only right thing to do okay so now um when it comes to the actual nutrition and things like that now i highly recommend you to get like a zinc picolinate it's a must in combination with natural vitamin d3 zinc picolinate and d3 are going to help you to boost your immune system are going to bring you so much energy and also at the same time you know uh, these two supplements are working absolutely superb together uh, zinc picolinate and natural vitamin d3 these are my own supplements 
supplements if you're aware of by now because these are made with like an exceptional quality without any horrible ingredients and they are suitable for both vegetarians and vegans and also another thing I was going to recommend you would be organic chlorella you can call me crazy that's absolutely entirely up to you used to it <laughs> entirely up to you but basically there are metals in the air the metals in the sky the metals in the soil in the ground in the plants they're absolutely sorry darling they're absolutely everywhere so these are very dangerous metals that can affect our bodies so organic chlorella has got the ability to dis detoxify these metals from your body but at the same time it's full of vitamins and minerals uh, 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 protein and omega-3 essential fatty acids which we acids which our body does not produce by itself but it's like a really kind of essential uh, so it's good for brain memory and this type of functions as well my supplements you can buy in the link um, the link is going to be in the description below or you can simply go on Google and just type in such a bonus in vitamins and you can see the page, uh, uh, my vitamin page come up that way. And if you're on any other medications, if you're pregnant or if you're breastfeeding, you just need to check with your doctor. You just need to check with your GP. Only your doctor or GP can tell you whether this can interact with your existing medications or not. So now my gorgeous Sagittarini, the very first date that I would like to talk to you about, it's actually going to be on the 1st of November. You're going to be worrying about something something is going to be on your mind something is going to be scaring you you're going to be worrying about something you're going to feel like a little bit anxious and just a little bit anxious and then this is only because you will already feel subconsciously that something is about to be resolved but you will not be able to understand what this is. By the time you get to the 2nd of November, you're going to get an important news and message, which is uh, really going to surprise you. And this news and message that you are going to have, it's really going to kind of like really surprise you because it's to do with an aspect of your life that hasn't been changing. Nothing was changing and it just became stale. It became boring and it became annoying. And you find yourself being so unhappy because of this aspect of your life because it didn't change, but you you, you just had to plod along, you know, and even more so, this aspect of your life started to make you feel like you're not moving on, like your hands are at the back, and it's just made you, it's starting to make you feel really, really frustrated in terms of, like, you're not being able to live your life the way, the way you want to live your life, to express yourself the way you want to express yourself in this life. It affected so many different aspects, but it's all coming from you uh, feeling too restricted, and it happens when it's an important aspect of our life our karma, our energy that we need to work on and, and it's just going to affect us in one way or another until something comes out of it, okay? So it's only about the necessary, only about waiting the necessary stage, you know, in, in our lives to come up. And November is the time for you, my gorgeous Sagittarini. So an important message you are going to get and on the 2nd of November, this is going to answer your question, what you were worrying about on the 1st of November. And this message is going to clearly show you the an art part of your life just moving on. And I like it so much because, as I said, this was something that made you feel so worried, but you knew that there is nothing you can do about it, but just wait and wait and wait. Now, the wait is slowly by surely over. So now you are going to find yourself thinking quite a lot in between the 2nd and, and the 9th of November, especially how you want to kind of, this is going to really make your energy really uh, uh, high. It's going to make you aware how much this was affecting you. It's going to make you feel ridiculously adventurous already. So the 2nd, on the 2nd of November, you know, in between the 2nd and the 9th of November, it's all about you feeling so adventurous about a certain move about a certain bold, powerful move that you're going to make. And you're not going to be able to make this move already, right now. But now what you need to do is there is still just a little bit of experience that you need to get, that you need to gain. And this little bit, a little bit of experience that you need to gain and that you need to get, this is going to make you aware that you should not rush at this stage in your life, but it is like kind of going to be on your mind. Which people do you need to kind of exactly be surrounded with with you will know exactly what i mean by the end of november you are already going to like not only be surrounded by the right people but there is something so special that it's going to come out of these people in terms of you uh, finding out exactly how you're actually going to do this <coughs> sorry 
So now the second important date, and before I go there, <coughs> sorry, I highly recommend you something like a, a, this gorgeous, gorgeous a red jasper, my gorgeous Sagittarini. This red jasper is a must, especially when we work on the different aspects of our life, but they're, they're all kind of connected with the same thing. When it comes to us feeling extremely passionate, and when it comes to us making the most of our own passion, there is a lot that is going to be happening throughout the month of November, and, and that is going to kind of steal or take your attention away from what you are doing. But especially when we are focusing on important parts of our life that we feel so passionate about that are directly connected to our spiritual journey and soul purpose, we always have challenges that are requiring from us to, to pay attention to that aspect of our life that we feel uh, uh, passionate about, which is not always easy because anything could happen that you're like, oh my God, you need to react really quickly, but you have to put yourself as a number one just remember that okay so this this gorgeous red jasper is something that i highly recommend you in order to bring your passion up but also in order to kind of feel feel that strong sense of direction that sometimes can just be lost a little bit it depends what's happening around us okay so the link to buy this is in the description below so now my gorgeous sagittarini <coughs> The second important date is um, 11th of November. Now, the 11th of November is the, uh, it's the this is the date. But before I go there, let me just tell you. Raise your vibration. Raise your vibration. Sagittarini. Sagittarini, Sagittari, Sagittari, Sagittarini, 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 Sagittari, Sagittari, Sagittarini, 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 Sagittari, Sagittari, Sagittarini, Sagittarini. Sagittarini, Sagittari, Sagittari, Sagittarini, Pam, 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 Pam 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 pa da pam pa da pam pa 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 da dam. Raise your vibration, my gorgeous Sagittarini. It's all what life is about. If they think you are crazy, fantastic, brilliant. It's a good sign. At least you're allowing yourself to be yourself. So now, my gorgeous Sagittarini, the 11th of November is like, oh God. You know that you are gonna have a bit of a tower situation here something it's again like gonna happen like oh my god this is really going to surprise you because almost as if like you were looking for something really uh, you were expecting something really positive really optimistic to happen but then is a dark lala coming in and is telling you like no baby no you just have to like kind of live through this now so the 11th of November you are going to become aware of the situation that it's really kind of you're going to find this mind blowing it's really going to surprise you it's a bit of a tower moment and that means that this is going to affect you but at that moment in time when you become aware of this tower moment you will know that something came to an end the certain stage the certain aspect it's going to of your life it's going to come to an end and this is going to throw you out of balance a little bit. It's going to like really kind of make you worried. It's going to surprise you a little bit, but trust me. And then and not that long after that moment in time, there is a very interesting message that you are going to have. And that message that you are going to have, it's going to make you aware of, oh my God, if that tower situation, if that situation didn't, didn't kind of happen, I would have been even wor in a worse place. Something really bad would happen to me. Something really bad and negative would ha happen to me. So you will understand this through that message that that you are going to have very shortly after that it's not about a bad experience it's not about negative experience it's not about what you feel about it and how you feel about it but what you've actually learned out of it there is something mind-blowing blowing invaluable that you've actually learned through this experience 
which is gonna make you aware of you're gonna become aware of that through that message that you're gonna get not that short after you're gonna realize on one hand that if you kind of stayed living this situation it would be terrible but then on another hand you're gonna realize that there is something really amazing that you've actually learned out of that experience and this is gonna give you strength and confidence and balance and that in its in, in itself it's going to reflect on, on your self-esteem because now in itself this is going to chime this is going to give you a chance to kind of change your life but it's also at the same time going to make you feel a kind of a really really curious about something and that particular curiosity it's about to meet the opportunity and it's not only so you see what curiosity it's actually going to come out of it on the 11th of November by the end of that day by the end of that day there is something that you're going to be really extremely like oh my god curious about okay that's the bottom line by the end of the day on the 11th of November there is something that you're going to feel extremely extremely curious about and that is going to be again highlighted on the 21st of November curiosity curiosity that mind-blowing curiosity it's about to meet the opportunity of your lifetime okay and also very clever thing for you to do on one hand this is something that you need to do now but on another hand this is going to give you an ultimate 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 happiness my gorgeous Sagittarini indeed by the time you get to the 24th of the actual November now the 24th of November just remember let me explain this so on the 11th you will know something that you're going to feel very curious about by the end of the day and then the 21st of november you again have the opportunity and chance to pay attention to and try to identify what this is what you feel so curious about because this is about to bring you the opportunity so now i'm jumping to the 24th of november you will see how everything was connected and on the 24th of november this is like when you are, are going to be like kind of like you're gonna feel extremely wise on this day you're gonna feel extremely deep on this day you're gonna be thinking like you know how you're gonna go like kind of deep and spiritual and you're gonna think like oh life is a brief and bright and the beautiful and mine to live that's how you're gonna think like like along those sides like along those lines like quite a lot like oh life is like kind of too short and I need to make the most of it yeah these are all great feelings and emotions because it's completely true i keep on saying this like kind of all the time like we are we are, that, that life goes like this you know we're like 50 60 70 80 90 100 you know people still feel like they're 20 so be it you know what i mean it's all about the spirit and it's about our soul but my point is to make to make the most of it so so when we are reminded of these things and we are just having these emotions and feelings how life is too short to waste blah 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 this is always good because this is going to be on your mind quite a lot on the 24th of November but this is also going to be comp contributing like there is no tomorrow towards you finally going for this exploring this is going to really reflect on you how do you know when I said that you will kind of like curiosity is going to meet the opportunity this the 24th of November is bringing you like a, a this kind of the stage where you're just going to be absolutely left with no option but to just go for it and this opportunity and this curiosity this is this is an aspect of your life now that you will know that you know you're just kind of like you will know what this is and you are going to make the necessary step but you're not going to be able to believe what is actually going to come out of it like a mind-blowing opportunity in between the 24th of november and the end of that month but on the 24th of november you will know what this this is it's about you making a step on the 24th of November and in between the 24th of November and the end of that month you will become aware of like oh my lord you know not only bright prospects that this is going to bring that you weren't aware of but the actual unlimited possibilities you know that this is actually going to bring and how much change this is going to bring into your life so this in itself the 24th it's also like kind of bringing the, the beginning of your transformation the beginning of your transformation you are going to start changing and transforming your life my gorgeous Sajj and it's precisely going to start on the 24th of November and you will know that you are making the right choice the wise choice what you're gonna do here it's gonna that wise choice that you are making it's also uh, going to a uh, really 
that wise choice that you are making here it's gonna make you uh, manifest this so what's happening right now it's also going to uh, bring you one of the most powerful most successful most significant manifestations of your life 11 12 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 by September or in September two th 2023 your life is gonna absolutely explode in the best possible way but I'm focusing on this particular manifestation this is all part of this manifestation all this process is part of your manifestation you feeling curious you finding out the opportunity you seeing unlimited possibilities this is all part of your manifestation this is all strong part of your manifestation you will see exactly what I mean you know there are gonna be a few different stages you will go through but trust me you are gonna understand this on the level you are meant to understand at this stage in your lives another thing I was going to recommend you <clears throat> sorry would be this gorgeous strawberry quartz strawberry quartz really brings you an inner peace it protects you gently but it also helps you to communicate and say the right things especially when you're speaking or talking to someone rather important this gorgeous strawberry quartz pendant comes with sterling silver chain and the link to buy this is in the description below as well so now my gorgeous Sagittarini I'm just going to see briefly what to pay attention to in the first part of November mid part of November in the last part of November in the first part of November you know it's just like a basically uh, you need to really work on those things that are making you feel insecure you need to work on those things that are making you feel insecure and you need to realize why are they making you feel insecure as well the mid part of November, you need to understand, my gorgeous Sagittarini, that basically, you know, you are going through a very important transition and change in your life. One phase is about to end and another phase is about to begin. So don't become like, don't be surprised when you feel so bored with certain aspects of your life. When you start realizing that you're feeling so bored and unhappy with a certain aspect of your life, this is also a sacred sign for you to understand that this came to an end and the last part of November it's absolutely brilliant because you are going to have a power like you haven't had in a long time especially when it comes to you transforming idea ideas and goals into the actual reality you're going to feel extremely confident about yourself extremely confident about your power because you will understand after a long time that you've got everything you possibly need in order to make one of the biggest steps of your lives so now my gorgeous Sagittarini <clears throat> I'm just going to see briefly uh, what is going to happen to those of you who are in a relationship now for those of you who are in relationship I like this so much because it looks like one specific male person very powerful strong amazing male person who is successful in both of their careers when it comes to their career but it's who is successful also when it comes to spirituality so that male person <coughs> sorry it's really going to inspire both of you and you need to kind of like really pay attention to this inspiration because that inspiration it's not going to seem like that at that moment in time but that inspiration uh, it's a really a going to help you to feel it both of you again some kind of a plan something that you wanted to do for such a long time and this is going to bring you one of the greatest accomplishments ever but it was also kind of slowed down and stuck in the process that man that powerful man it's really going to inspire both of you to do the right thing okay because this is not only going to be the right thing to do but it's going to bring you like a really powerful uh, aspect of your life becoming the actual reality in terms of the actual accomplishment and having things in life and enjoying things in life that you don't necessarily have right now so this is obviously the way to go for the couples my gorgeous Sagittarini so as soon as someone like inspires you just go for it you know uh, you could be that person can tell you the advice but I think it's more about you kind of becoming aware of what that person did and you're both going to be like yeah let's do that you know you should just go for it indeed for those of you who are single and ready to mingle my gorgeous Sagittarini first of all you need to understand there is a, some kind of unhealthy attachment that you have 
there is a, some kind of unhealthy attachment around you no baby no so for those of you who are single you need to let someone go I don't like that person because it's like a some kind of like a temptation I'm not telling you to split up don't get me wrong um, I'm telling you that I don't I don't say things to people like this you you you, you do your own decisions <clears throat> And as I said, as I said, I, I um, basically, um, what I was going to say now, Sagittarini, da 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 yeah, it, this is for single, I was thinking, you see, this is for the single, uh, uh, this is for you who are single, Sagittarini, so it's not someone who, had a, who you had a relationship with, but it could be somebody from the past that you're still holding on to, or it could be someone like, maybe like from like a few weeks ago, like a stranger in the night, do -do 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 -do, Sagittarini in the moment, in the morning, mom. you know, it could be like such a terrini in the morning uh, moment you know so it could be somebody who you like had a, had a relationship with like a long time ago or it could be someone who you just really liked it could be someone who you like really fancied and you're just constantly thinking about them the bottom line is you need to release this person because this person is the part of the, the, the temptation and I don't actually like this person it's the part of the temptation but also at the same time it created a very very unhealthy attachment for some some reason I do see that person who you still who you are still holding on to as the part of like the progress being slowed down for you uh, when it comes to someone very special coming into your life but for some reason I also see this as a difficult choice to make for you there is a certain difficult choice that you're gonna need to make first maybe you're going somewhere where you're still hoping to be with someone around someone but you know that that's not a good person for you Okay, so it's to do with it like a difficult choice that you're going to need to make as soon as you do that You are giving a sign to your spirit that you trust yourself So as soon as you do this things are going to start changing for you only a few days later Something is going to come to you like where to go and what to do and that is going to bring a person into your life But first of all you need to realize who this is and you need to make that decision indeed Okay, my gorgeous Sagittarini, thank you ever so much for watching my videos. I'm sending you brightest blessings, lots of love, healing, peace and light to every single one of you. Thank you ever so much for watching my videos. Sasha Bonas in Psychic Medium. Love you. Bye.